All right, this is supposed to be my fastest filming ever. So our Arma, my Armageddon plant, lots of fruit on it. Tomato plant, Tabasco plant. Pretty good with the fruit. Sriracha, check out all the fruit on it. It's just tons. Same with the Demon Red over here. There's two plants in this, just like the Sriracha. Tons of fruit as well, two in this one. This is our Habanero. Look at all the fruit in this one. That's a, a good angle, that's a good angle. Look at all that fruit. Then we got the uh, Hungarian wax that started to um, throw up some flowers again. It's been un in repairs, as you know, so, but it's doing much better now. Everything's looking better, even the leaves. The cherry tomatoes looking great over there. Regular tomatoes looking great. Regular tomato as well, getting started. Then we have this cayenne here. It's just it's so many peppers on it. So, so, so many. That one's the red cayenne, by the way. Then this one is lemon drop. These are going to be lemon uh, yellow peppers, I should say. I think it's from Peru. Lots of, uh, well, not too many. Lots more than I thought uh, on it. We have another cherry tomato doing extremely well here. And then a regular tomato, it's got some flowers on it. You can see our basil plant. That was just from a cutting. I need to take some more off that to get it to grow again. Somebody gifted me something that's kind of like a bok choy. I removed a bunch of leaves from it and then put it back in the ground to see how we can do. This is supposed to be a Jamaica red though it doesn't exactly look like uh, the ones that I've grown in the past so maybe um, something else is going on or maybe they're just gonna fill up I don't know then we have the uh, other cayenne this one's the Ristra cayenne Let's see you can, there's some definitely some really big peppers in there if you can see through it it's just a cluster in in here it's just such a big cluster there's a big one back there but yeah, it's a cluster, cluster. And then Armageddon, again, just tons of peppers. Well, not too, too many, but there's a good number of peppers there and they're doing really well. And then last but not least, our biggest tomato plant. This one's the bicolor cherry tomato. It's just gonna be throwing up so much fruit. When I get back, I'm gonna give it a bunch of, um, of uh, nutrients so it can be nice and happy. Just in case, I'm not sure what's going on with these leaves over here. But let's just take that one off for it. Maybe take off both just in case. And then over here, I threw in a bunch of uh, seeds from some bell peppers. So I'm going to see if those start. Obviously, they've taken off so far. So let's see how they do. It's going to be a late, late, late harvest for those if, if anything comes at all. So, yeah. Wanted to be nice and quick with this one. It's under five minutes, so I think I did my job. And uh, yeah, so far so good. Oh yeah, and last but not least, I just threw up, because it's gonna rain, I'm gonna be out of town for a couple days, so I threw my little ones over here so they're not just constantly getting flooded, like they always do. So hopefully they appreciate that. Hopefully my apple, oh geez, my apple. Trees. I think I should probably upplot them, but yeah, we'll do that next time. I still think that's a spider plant as well. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah, there we go. All right, adios, and have a great day, everyone. Happy anniversary to my mom and dad.